back to Olympics covers this morning. We know the NHL decided not to send its players to the Olympics this year, and that decision meant one American hockey player who made his Olympic debut four years ago would not get the chance to play in Beijing. For more on that, we check back with David Molko. And David, today we're talking about Jordan Greenway. You know, talking about making a mark at the very top so early, Jordan Greenway really has cemented himself as one of the exciting young players in the NHL, though it's his accomplishments at the games in South Korea that really have him breaking barriers. Jordan Greenway has done it all at just about every level hockey has to offer. He was born in Canton, New York, and was skating at the early age of three. Greenway wanted to get better at the sport he loved, so he went to high school in Minnesota, where he grew as a player and a person. And as luck would have it, in 2015, he was drafted by the Minnesota Wild. Three years later, at the age of 21, he made history when he became the first African-American to compete for the United States men's hockey team at the Olympic Games. Greenway has a rare mix of size and skill, which the forward put on display in Pyeongchang, scoring a goal against Slovenia. Team USA finished seventh in the men's Olympic hockey tournament. A month after competing in the Olympics, Greenway made his NHL debut where he helped the Wild advance to the Western Conference playoffs. Scoring a goal in the first round victory over the Jets. Greenway is the first person in hockey history to compete in the Olympics, NCAA tournament, and Stanley Cup playoffs in the same season. Yeah, busy guy. He's in his fifth season in the NHL. He's helped take the Wild to the playoffs in three of the last four years. By the way, he's a forward, of course. He just signed a three-year contract extension $9 million over Ooh. three years. I like the sound of that payday. Yeah. Thanks, David.